The Magicians came to an end with Season 5 back in 2020, but there are a number of spin-offs that could work based on the characters and storylines introduced over the course of its run, and the best choice would be even darker than the original sci-fi series. Adapted from Lev Grossman's best-selling novels, The Magicians offers a bleaker-than-normal take on the fantasy genre's magic school trope. It also introduces a grimmer version of C.S. Lewis' Narnia, delivering a fantasy show that upends viewer expectations and feels more mature than other stories like it. Despite its darker themes, The Magician's ending is a fairly optimistic one, and it's definitive enough that returning to the original narrative would be a mistake. However, the world and lore within The Magician's universe leaves the door open for adventures separate from those of Quentin and his classmates. The perfect Magician spin-off would be a prequel following the Chatwin family. Although there are several The Magician spin-offs that could expand upon the original show, a prequel following the Chatwin family would undoubtedly be the most interesting way to continue the story. The Chatwins play an important role in The Magicians, as the siblings discover theory prior to the series' main characters. Each of them goes on to have their own adventures, which are covered in the theory and further book series Quentin loves. Quentin also meets several of the adult Chatwin siblings during The Magicians, though they're a far cry from the characters he grew up reading about. Each of the Chatwin children has interesting narratives to explore in a spin-off, but Jane and Martin would be especially interesting to follow. Chronicling their early journey to Fiery would show viewers what the world was like prior to the Magicians, while later seasons could reveal how Jane and Martin became the characters seen in the original show. Martin's perspective would serve as a villain origin story, meaning any Magician spin-off focused on the Chatwins would be inherently darker than its predecessor. Jane's tale also ends in tragedy, but that doesn't mean it's not worth exploring. Martin Chatwin's fate would make this spin-off series darker than the original. The Beast sits in a chair in a destroyed room in the Magicians. Martin Chatwin becomes the magician's villain dubbed the Beast after his adventures with his siblings in Fiery, and his dark turn would undoubtedly be fascinating to witness in real time. The Beast is born of Martin's pain, and his backstory includes a history of sexual abuse at the hands of the Fiery and further author Christopher Plover. While this aspect of Martin's origin story would be difficult to digest, it would elicit sympathy for him as a character and allow viewers to fully understand his side of the story. Martin's rise to power and early years ruling Fiery would also be interesting to see, as would his back and forth with his sister, Jane. Jane attempts to end Martin's reign with the help of Breakbill students, and she fails repeatedly in these efforts. Martin eventually finds a way to kill her in The Magician Season 1, so Jane's story is destined to be a tragedy. However, the years she spends opposing her brother are shrouded in mystery, and judging by her personality in the original show, they'd be fun to watch even if viewers know she'll fail. How a Darker Magician's Prequel Could Work Elliot and Margot Looking Perplexed in the Magicians The early seasons of the Magicians are compelling because of their bleak tone and realistic approach to fantasy storytelling. Leaning into these strengths would only help a Magician spin-off, especially if the Chatwin's backstory is handled correctly. The difficult topics a prequel of this nature would cover could work to its advantage, allowing the series to comment on subjects that are, unfortunately, still relevant in the real world. The complicated sibling relationships that evolve from the characters' time in Fiery would also offer a unique on-screen dynamic. With prequels like House of the Dragon and Better Call Saul seeing massive success, it's clear that audiences don't mind knowing where certain characters will end up at the end of a spin-off, and they don't seem to care that many series like these build to unhappy endings. The fact that the siblings' early days in Fiery aren't so terrible means the shift will be jarring. Still, with the right approach, the magicians can successfully tap into the Chatwin story, even if parts of it are already set in stone.